Jordan and Salish Matter finally went to see Nadal after his accident and it seems like Nadal has forgot who Salish is. Make sure you watch right into the end to see that. This is Nadal Wonder's car accident update. Now if you don't already know, Nadal Wonder was recently in a car accident and he got taken to the hospital because of this and he was put to sleep for many days. But in this clip we have him talking for the first time after the accident and you won't believe what he said at the end. But make sure you like this video and subscribe right now to show your support for Nadal. You're hitting yourself in the corner? You just remember going to sleep and waking up here? Do you remember anything here in the hospital? You just remember right now? Do you remember riding your scooter and then getting hit by a car? Never. How long ago was it? Four days ago. Yeah, four days, you know. Yeah, you got hit four days ago. Still in the hospital. Yeah, it was pretty bad, you know. You broke your head, you broke your collarbone, you broke your leg. You don't move too much, don't move too much. You remember going in the ambulance? No, I just like the way. No, we're not. You're falling asleep. Now at this point a lot of fans were concerned if Nadal even remembers who Salish is because people were asking him on social media and he wasn't really giving an exact response but you won't believe what he said when he started waking up a bit in this next clip. Nadal, what's good? How you doing? You know we all thought you were dead Nadal for like three days. Four days actually. Still feel bad. You just woke up yesterday. You got pretty beat up. Look at your even your collarbone's blue, like it's a different color. Yeah. Your shoulder, your I eye. Can't, I can't lay on this side. You can't lay on it? They didn't do surgery right here. Yeah, I know, they didn't do surgery. Look at your leg. Look at this leg, Needle is broken. It's strong. Yeah. Needle's gonna come back and be stronger than ever. No, no, you're chilling. Look at you. You remember everything. You guys start hitting the gym because you're losing a lot of weight. Look at that, you lost so much weight being in here. I was bulking and I stopped working out. <laughs> and then you got hit. You're cutting, you're just cutting right now. Alright, you all. I'll see you later. Take care, I'm glad you're feeling better. We love you. But that's not all guys, because just before we show Salish and Jordan going to see him at the end, in this next clip, we actually have Nadal going back to the hospital to get his staples out of his head and a few other different things, and you won't believe what was shown at the end. When Nadal got into an accident, he broke his head and now he is going to the hospital for a checkup and to get the staples out of his head. Guys, this looks so painful. Look how many staples are in his head. There are 30 of them. After they took the staples out of his head, the doctors checked his leg. His injured leg appears to be a different color than his other leg. This is what his left leg looks like after the accident. Then the dog gets to pick his calf color. He is thinking of what color. Juju wants you guys to guess which one he's picking. Comment down below your thoughts. Nadal chose the color blue, but he ended up hating it later on. What do you guys think? Don't forget to subscribe for more updates. But Salish Mata started crying after seeing this next clip because a few days later, because this story got so big, Nadal was actually on live TV on the news explaining about his accident and you won't believe what he revealed at the end of the interview. On well, new at 11, a Clovis teen and YouTube star is now at home and recovering after getting hit by a car while riding an electric scooter. Nadal Wonder has 2.2 million followers on YouTube where he shares funny videos with his brother, but for the past week, he has been fighting for his life. I'm very lucky to be in a wheelchair and not in the hospital right now. One week after getting hit by a car riding his electric scooter, Needall Wonder is home from the hospital and surrounded by his family. They, like, put me to sleep for, like, five days. I was in a coma for five days, basically. The 13-year-old YouTube star has over 2 million followers, and his videos regularly get hundreds of thousands, if not millions, of views. He films anything from pranks to challenges with his friends. You gotta see. You gotta see. No, you're seeking. But on March 5th, his mom, Adrika Ajib, says she got the call no mother wants to get. Her other son called her and let her know Nidal had been hit by a car. 
Really what I started to do was just pray. And he was already loaded in the ambulance. So his mum is starting to explain her side of the story right now. And it gets very emotional at the end. And when Salish saw this, she started crying. And they were about to take him away. So I was just kind of there trying to piece together what just happened. After a full week in the hospital fighting for his life, the full scope of his injuries are now clear. Head injuries being the most critical with brain bleeding and swelling leaving him with staples on his head. He has a fractured collarbone, bruised ribs, a broken leg, just to name a few. Adrika says the last week has been incredibly tough, but she put her faith in God. I really just let it all go in God's hands and I said, he's yours. I hope that you let us keep him, but he's yours. Needall says he doesn't remember what happened before or during the crash. However, he's staying positive and excited to get back to making YouTube videos when he can. Like God definitely helped in the situation. Like without him, I, I probably would still be in the hospital. But just before we show Salish and Jordan Matter finally seeing the Dow, this was actually Salish's response to this accident. Now she made a post saying, Dear Nadal, I hope you feel better. I miss you so much and I can't wait to see you again sometime soon. I hope you have a really fast recovery and thank you so much for being the best friend ever. And I hope you stay optimistic even though it will be challenging. And as well as that, she also posted all of these pictures of them two together. But a few days after this, because Salish was so upset about this situation, Salish and Jordan flew out to Nadal State to see him in real life, to check on him. And whilst they were there, they were making a lot of posts together, but many fans were saying it still seems like Salish was very upset about this. But the very recent update about this accident has just been released, because on Juju Snapchat chat story which is Nadal's brother he has been posting recent pictures of Nadal recovering and the last one is shocking because it seems like Nadal doesn't even know who Salish is so make sure you watch to the end Right here, it seems like Nadal might not know who Salish is yet, but comment down below what you think. It seems like he's having a fast recovery, which is amazing. But if you guys have watched right into the end of the video, make sure you click onto one of these two videos on the screen right now, because they're insane. So click one right now and peace out.